1799, Solomon Bailey, who lived from 1771 to 1839, escaped slavery and inadvertently established Camden as a stop on Delmarva's Underground Railroad route. During his escape, he narrowly avoided capture by two slave hunters. After praying for protection, he noticed a circle of birds around him, which he believed to be a sign from the Lord. When the slave hunters came close, they veered off, leaving Solomon to continue his journey to freedom. Bailey sought refuge in Kent County, where the Camden Congregation of Friends, a Quaker group with abolitionist views, was located. Later in 1825, he wrote a widely read autobiography, a narrative of some remarkable incidents, which detailed his escape and helped establish Camden as a safe haven for runaway slaves. A generation later, Harriet Tubman, who lived from 1820 to 1913, made her own escape from slavery. Born about 75 miles from Camden, Tubman relied on the help of local underground railroad conductors like William and Nat Brinkley and Abraham Gibbs. It is possible that Tubman learned of Camden's role in the Underground Railroad from Philadelphia abolitionist William Still and others familiar with Bailey's autobiography. By detailing his escape and the role of the Camden Congregation of Friends in his autobiography, Solomon Bailey helped pave the way for Harriet Tubman's successful journey through Delaware. Although Tubman might not have been aware of Bailey's story, her own escape and later work as an underground railroad conductor owe a debt of gratitude to his courageous path blazing.